Have you been to Ham before? You know, that little valley west of East Ham Woods where Captain Lodestein hangs out. Hello, welcome back to Cassette Beast. Uh, I just booted up the game and decided to check out that rumor, but I actually wanted to uh, change my outfit before I started recording. But uh, last time, uh, we raided the Morning Town and witnessed Dorian die, but uh, <laughs> then we fought an Archangel and stuff happened. Uh, as I said today, I'm going to change my character's outfit real quick, and, um... We're gonna do some more exploring around. Mostly what I just wanted to change was... Make favorite color the same color as the bottom of the poncho. Hope someone's here liking Ultra. Okay, cool. Oh yeah, we gotta, uh, we already need some quests while we're here. Oh, what do you have? Joel does a monster wearing diving gear that grants the ability to swim in any water as you've recorded. That's definitely one we gotta look out for. Greetings! Greetings, my assistants. Have you recorded a mystery monster? Yes. Huh? Huh? It was real? I never would have guessed. The Thwackalope, I see. It is curious how our myths and legends appear to influence the appearance of monsters here on New World. Say, can I ask you some questions about your world from before you came here? I'm also trying to catalog all the various realities that Harper Town's residents hail from. Sure. Excellent. Excellent. I'll simply ask a series of questions relating to the broad historical events you can tell me if they seem familiar to you. Question 1. Are you familiar with the Roman Empire? Yep. Question 2. Did the Industrial Revolution occur in your world's past? Yep. Question 3. Did mankind ever land on the moon? Yes. Right. Right. Last question. Has the Day of the Birds happened yet? Yet? Uh, don't worry about that one. If I tell yourself lucky, you don't know what I mean. I don't know why I meant. Thanks for since again, take this for your troubles. I love that scene so much. Got the penny dreadful in the air, it's murmuring about a crow with a hood and a mask in the deadlands. Well, that's definitely one we gotta look out for. That's the one to see what we can make with get with our uh, stuff here. Boltino cartridge drive. Having one of these in pocket will upgrade your Boltino dash to inflict damage at the start of a battle if it was in use before the battle started. I think I'm going to take a victory mod so our, except our fusion meter increases when we win a battle. Today, I want to get a new party member before we do anything else. Ooh, whoops, uh, game. Thank you. Ah. Dang these old mooks. So, trying to remember how to get up here, but I think I already got it. Oh yeah, I'm high enough, although they'll run away now instead of running at me. Oh. Oh, the new boy. Have we met? Holy Lake was babbling on about you when he came by to pick up some parts from my shop. Or when he came by to pick up parts from my shop. Have you met him? He's the worst. <laughs> You know he's not even a real scientist? Before he landed on New World, he was a data analysis or analyst. Someone needs to tell him that only wearing t-shirts that say I love science is not a personality. I'm Meredith. No, anyway, I'm Meredith. You like being trapped on this rock forever with the rest of us if you, until you die. Doesn't seem so bad. Uh... There's like, what, a couple hundred people here, Max? We have things to talk about pretty quick, trust me. And if I need a breath of fresh air, come even my shop in town sometime. Yell building on the boardwalk.
And sure, let's go meet with her. Oh, you again. I have something to ask you. Are we really going to be searching for a way off this island? Yes. Huh. Huh. I almost admire your optimism. Well, if we're going to do the whole travel across the land thing, could you do look out for something for me? Sure, what are you looking uh... for? It's, um, a music record. You know what that is? Of course, why wouldn't okay. I? Okay, cool. It's, uh, hard to know who knows what around here. Not everyone comes from similar worlds. It makes it pretty hard to talk to people, harder than usual, even. Anyway, the record. It's an album. All I ever needed by The Witch House. Maybe you heard of it. I used to listen to it back in my previous life. It has sentimental value, okay? There are a few music nerds in Harbor Town reckoning you can ask around for me. You can ask the residents if they've seen Meredith's favorite record. Now, we need to ask Ganth, who is at the Ranger HQ. Yeah, just a thought on your mind. All I ever needed by the witch house. Remember, that's looking for a music record. You must know your chance to find this particular record are pretty close to zero, right? Real, I can't empathize with that. I can't empathize that enough. Things that end up in New World come from a lot of different worlds, you know. Nonetheless, you might have some luck and fall down mall. Oh, of course, you're new. There's a shopping complex on the north side of New World, totally abandoned, just popped into being around 15 years ago. That's where you get all the clothes for the locals, not to mention our cassette players and tapes. There's a music shop in the mall filled with records and cassette tapes, but we keep it all locked up for security. Cassette supplies are pretty important after all, it's a good idea to keep them safe. If the record is there, Meredith might need to risk your life to go get it. Rational part of me wants to formally forbid her from trying, but if you go with her, maybe it's a little safer. Here, take this. Envelope for Meredith. Oh. And while I'm here, might as well go ahead and just plant some bushes in here. Alright, so now we... Huh? What's this, a letter? Oh. what it say? Uh... The note from Amp says my record might be in Fallout Mall, that I have permission to go, but only if you accompany me. So I have to include the keys to get in. <laughs> Shall I go then? You sure? Don't worry, I can defend myself. You didn't think you would have my own cassette player, did you? <sighs> Sitting around here all day is killing me. Playing that album is just something I strive for, I guess. It's like, if you don't have something to keep you going, you might as well be dead, right? Do you know what's driving you right now? I'll find a way back home. Like I said to you before, that's impossible, but if you help me find a record, I'll help you find your way home. Why not, right? Something to do to strive for, after all. We got Meredith as a partner, and we get her tape, which is a Catelli. We saw this thing earlier. The Catelli's only way to communicate is through the static patterns on its television-like face. These messages are often difficult to decipher, and this hurdle often prevents the common Catelli from being able to catch up with other creatures. Bleh. Smack, criticize, and charge. Achilles returns to the cafe, and now we... I have to go and get stuck in, the, stuck in this town, that town this stole, did I? Yeah. I'm actually going to put Eugene back in the party for now, because we're actually not going to go north, we're actually going to explore this bottom corner of the map today. But first, let's Bonjour. restock up, and I'll also buy one of these. Au revoir. do is just go south from here. Wound up in the right place to find that hooded crow that Hoya like wants us to find. The Deadlands. Okay, I see what we have to do here. Uh oh. Oh, 
wins with the method action Discord. Plastic Grounded passively reduces the coming lightning damage by 50%, negates any reactions that would occur, and does not affect critical hits. Neat. Up there, someone right behind nothing. Moving monster skills here for months now. Let me show you the results of my training. Uh, let's bring heal. Standard NPCs won't have any more than two tapes. I still have a lot more training to do. And we have the ability to go down here while we're over here. So every in-game day, you want to check over here because you'll find a random item here. Sometimes it's materials, but other times you can find genuinely useful items like tapes and uh, status healing items. So keep an eye out for them. Ah, and this is the creature we were looking for. A never walk. I think I really like the name of. Well, I'll do the chrome tape. Make this easy. Also, I really like that Eugene's just doing a JoJo pose. Except with an air wall, that's not gonna matter. <laughs> that's just gonna happen every time. Good thanks to Mason Smoke Evasion. Alright! No, 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 no. It must be noted that the Nevermort does not appear to have a beak, rather it is wearing what appears to be a porcelain plague doctor mask. What lies beneath the mask is something that's better left undiscovered. Creepy. Rapid fire that. That's a pretty blast. And that will kill that crab. And that's the end of that. No, no, no. We'll go back to Hoy Lake later. Now we can actually go up to this upper area here. Uh... This is the ruins of New London. Nobody in New World seems to agree on the basic historical facts. Let's. Some choose to, some choose to accept the idea of a multiverse, but I think the island is just full of liars. For instance, a lot of people here that deny that the 1969 Mars landing happened. Conspiracy freaks love them. Propped. Nice. There goes the wall. Wing gloom. Flame. Brick blast. And he's going to die to the burn. And he missed. Next to the thing insulated. 
Wait. No, not you too. Wait. Please give me the creeps. Ooh, we gotta look for stones. Call story, plastic and pulp. There is a creature here that I actually do want to find. It's not the Nevermorts. Might be when I can spring heal. No, oh, that's a snooping. Skin. That's the other ev evolution of uh, Spring Heal. Sands of Time, that's a new creature that we can get. This, I'm not expecting this to succeed. I'm just going to waste time here and without doing any much. Nineteen percent chance. That's going to go even lower. I'll be very surprised if this goes through. Damn it! Nah, did not work. Significantly higher chance. Yep, there goes that hot skin. 100% chance. Earth coating, that fails. If it doesn't fail, it just changes his colors, that's it. He's already Earth type. The core of Sands of Tides appear like our broken hour glass heads. Any sand separated from such a mush will become entirely inanimate. Firstly, sand sign can grow a mass when they contact with sand. Very slow, but generally high stats otherwise. Wheat and pulp. And we have a little turning puzzle here. Turn the magic crab statues, and we get that chest unlocked. Let's see if we can just find the thing I'm looking for. Riptera, that's the final evolution of the Hopskin. Finding it. We'll find it some other time here. For now, we have something else we can do here. First, yes. Well, I'll have to heal up Cloxley. I can probably use my upgrade here to upgrade to uh, upgrade Cloxley to its final form, but oh, I forgot about this guy, the Landkeeper. Science perfect urban development opportunity. I found it first. I'm going with the landkeeper.
Ooh, that, that works. have an inflame on you. There'll be more opportunities for me, I'm sure. And you're gone. Let's see what we... I don't need to actually have focus on here. Let's heal that, so... Ricochet has a higher chance of going off. Plus more HP, too. Apologies if you hear anything in the background. Dogs are going outside, but... Family can handle that. They call this place New London once. Harper Town has a lot of residents and rate to establish tiny new settlement. I grew up here, you know, spent my whole childhood here hearing stories of the real London town. Sounds like a normal place. Cutthroats, highwaymen, vampires, I'm really fascinated by it. I don't know if those were all true stories. Oh. Of course, the town burned down, all the stories were lost, everyone everything here went for flank too, except little old me. Penny dreadful. Penny Dreadful, Ranger Captain, Cheater of Death here in the flesh. That's an odd nickname. Buyers in Harbor Town have a lot of different beliefs, but all agree on one thing, we're all gonna kick the bucket eventually. They simply lack I think they simply lack imagination. Death isn't the end, if you know the esoteric ways. I can give you a demonstration if you think you're ready for it. You're the latest Ranger training, right? Look for a scrap to prove your worth. Let's crack on. Let's crack on then. We expect me to go softly just because I'm a Ranger Captain, you're in for a proper fight. Hmm, haunt. Ghostly characters not be hit by attack, but are defeated instantly when the timer under ghostly status runs out. So in other words, we basically gotta survive for three turns. Actually, I'll use my turn to heal. Lost here. Then I'll hit him with the torrent. Attacks will erode defenses on me. And you'll use Dog Ears to extend that timer, so we gotta really kill that at the same time. Ow. And there it goes. Eugene, but that's fine. That's lower evasion. Enough. Enough of this. You need slapping down. That's what I was looking for, but I couldn't find it.
right. And that's a KO. All right, then. Wheat, metal, plastic, pulp, and wood. <laughs> I'm bloody impressed. Even, shi even shifting myself from this mortal plane was enough to stop him coming out on top. Here's your reward for defeating the immortal Penny Dreadful. You get step seven. We're definitely doing this way out of order, but whatever. <laughs> Dog ears, fuse material, and all of up. Remember, Trinity, if life is what you make of it, then death is too. Not quite sure what that means, but it feels profound. <laughs> yeah, I was trying to find a gin and tonic, which doesn't normally spawn normally, but you gotta find it somewhere. Thunderblast, snake skin tape, and plastic. Right, we have a camp here, which well, I'll take full advantage of. Eugene discusses the differences between your two worlds. Okay, so to make navigation easier, I think we're going to leave these last four tiles for uh, much later. And we'll explore the rest of this area at a later date. For now, though, I want to get Clockly up to rank 5 and remaster it first. I have a special bond with the Nifremorts around here. Better not get in our way. Birdfan and two Nifremorts. And he has the remastered form of Nevermore, Apocalypse. He's setting up a bunch of walls on one thing. Hmm. That will take down the, acrop the apocalypse. Are right, you gonna try to spit on me? Regardless, I'm just gonna die this turn regardless if the crochet goes off, but it did go off anyway. I was really close. Just get off the birds. The easiest way to get levels is through rogue fusion, though. So, let's see if I can find one around here. Oh yeah, since we're here anyway, and we have the ability to break the rock in here, let's, uh... Oh no, Rogue Fusion's in here now. Let's deal with this, then. Karna Heal. Spring Heal Karna Viper. Ow, that hurt. wall on oof okay ah, I did not go off Ugh.
Hey, you really don't like Eugene, huh? Ugh. Uh, Eugene might be going down. Uh, okay, no, he won't. He'll be fine. Rank 5. Elements of Wall and AP Doni on Clocksley. And then let's go ahead and go remaster some stuff and we'll switch out our party. This is mostly why I wanted Eugene in the party. I just wanted to remaster his tape before I take a new party member around. Oh, sometimes you'll see your party uh. members interact here too. I don't really get it. What is the internet? Had people in Harbor Town are crying over how much they miss it. Uh... You know, the internet? Like on computers or phones? On phones? Do you speak to people over it? What's the current year in your world before you came here, Meredith? 1989, why do you ask? Oh. Oh. Okay. Maybe I can see mate we're maybe a little out of sync with each other. What do you have? Get some buffies, my favorite. We're out in Cherry Meadow. We can't even go to Cherry Meadow yet. That's gonna be a while before we can go over there. Hmm. Man, that ruined town we passed really creeped me out. Reminded me of some places like see back home. Towns where people used to live all to high and swift or all to abandon. I, I don't even know why I just said, but whatever. I see a lot of those, actually. Maybe in time, people harp town can go back and build it all back up again. I'd like to see that happen. Broken tapes have been repaired and let's remaster. Clocksley becomes Robin Dum. Robin Dums are keen shots with their plastic bows and arrows. They're able to accurately strike a target with such up arrow from 200 meters out. They pride themselves in their keen aim, their keener sense of justice. And Fossetier becomes Fountess. Fountess takes a lot of pride in manners, the etiquette, and their own behavior. And that of others, if they perceive someone acting uncouth, they are immediately distressed, which drastically increases the pressure and chains the water pouring from their heads. I'm also going to change stuff in my storage here. You can say, why not? But you must want a Toku sect in storage, too. I think we're about done with them right now. For now. Put, put Carnaviper in the party. And Squirey. No, not Start a grade, actually. Now we'll switch out our party. Let's put Kaylee back in the party for now because we can actually increase her relationship level. Now we can't with Meredith or Eugene yet. We gotta finish their quest. Go. Oh. I'm telling you, Bob, something's shifted the natural plane lately. All the ghosts are talking about is some big players back on board, they're saying. Oh. All the ghosts? Yeah. <laughs> of course, there are all sorts of spirits, shade and tulpas hanging out in the natural plane. Where do you think I get my best intel from? Uh -huh. I'll take your word for it. Greetings, my eager assistant. Have you recorded our mystery monster? Yes, we have. Excellent. Excellent. Once again, you proved to be a capable researcher. Nevermore, is it? 
Last we have but one monster left on my list of pressing investigations. The answer herself has spoken a creature that flees when it catches even a glimpse of a human being. It's supposedly a wooden faced elf in the park. Sounds like something you'd be able to record and I wish you good fortune. ran into a traffic crowd. Trust me, we'll have our first battle with Meredith as, at a later date. I just wanted to pick her up so I don't forget about it later. And also we have an objective to work towards of getting to the mall in the first place. Um, immediately, here's the thing we're looking for. Recording. An elfless. Is it helpless? But who knows? Okay, is that for on me? Yep. And that's a guaranteed off list we got now. Got it. In order to hide their true emotions, Alpha's fashion crude smiling mask out of tree bark. Unsubstantiated rumors claim that there's one day a year where all Alphas assemble together and replace their old masks with new ones. And even stats all around the board. And that should kill both. Oh, did not kill Dominoff. Alright. Ow. Alright, this should at least do it. Toxic Stab and Meditate. Now we explore to the north. Uh oh. Hey you, this place isn't safe. Ooh, Palin Palagolin. Pangolin Paladin. That's basically what the name means. Palagolin, I think that's how you pronounce it. Togusak, too. Let's the Ven Demon and Sonic Boom. Wrench strike on Corner Viper. Oh. Somehow I think you'll be all right. Ooh, this is a uh, this is a terrain-based rogue fusion that we gotta take care of. It's a poison one. Another random rogue fusion here, that's not the one we want to take care of. Ooh, alright. I 
Now this is the one we gotta kill. Those poison types, I think we should be fine. Domedusa, Dominoff. So it's a bit of a waste, but whatever. Now I heal too. Yeah. Excuse me. Him with the fusion power. Sonic Boom Blast. Did not do much, but it gave us melee defense. Characters multi striker will each move twice if they have enough AP for it. Ricochet, thank you. And that will do the kill there. Okay. Thank you. Three. Should we go off again? There we go. Then that's the end of that. Echolocation. Use automatically start of battle to zero AP gives you a multi target task for three turns. That's a really good move to have on Haley. One of the reasons why I really like using her. Okay. Rachel Wallace, the team of Ace Builders, built Spiritual a while ago. Anyway, now we're back here. <laughs> hmm. I wonder what life is like for the citizens of Harbor Town who were born here. I mean, this whole world is all they ever known. Yet yeah, people like us keep describing whole worlds of people and places. I find it hard to comprehend what we're talking about. But then on the other hand, they're much more used to the ever-present monster population. Which I guess very much is a town of two halves. This bush is a creature, it's a bush eye. Now first I want to try to get rid of them. Oh, it gets low fluffs of all, that's right, I forgot about that.
destroyed the game. Both. Alright. Ah, oh, you missed the wing loom. Ow, Thunder Blast. Boom. Uh, 100% chance to record the bush eye. Please set the wing loom too. Thank you. And there we go. We got another new creature for us. Bush eye. Bush eyes are almost exclusively found hiding among bushes, which gives them the ability to both hide predators and sneak up on prey. They can lie motionless during and hiding for hours at a time. So they're dozing off, missing their mobile pounce on their targets. We are actually running out of time. We didn't really accomplish much this episode, but next episode we should be able to accomplish a lot. Oh, whoops. I'll fight Charles Darwin here. For, for the last thing we'll do this episode. Zalan taught me that it's not strong the species that survives, nor even knows intelligent, but the one adaptable to change. Let's transform. Uh, we're running out of time, but that's alright. We'll have a longer than usual episode. See if I can actually kill him before he gets his next tape in. Oh yeah, I definitely will. Oh yeah. You kill him before you figure out what his second tape is. It's funny, but I don't think it's really that great. Got Surefire, which I don't remember what that does. We can just double check it again. I don't really care what he has to say. You can pause it if you want and want to read it. So next time on Cassette Beasts. Oh, the arrow time only moves forward. Haley, arrow of what? Oh, just something my dad used to say. Guess it means our time marches on, can't turn back to clog, change our mistakes. We shouldn't dwell on the past. Even when we want to. <laughs> Guess I mean, you start thinking about the next step in our adventure. After all, the arrow time only moves forward, Ultra. Alright, next time on Cassette Beasts, we will explore up a bit north into East Ham Woods and try to locate them all. I'll see you guys then.